Please pause for the moment of silence. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Good morning, Bobcat Nation. Welcome back to Bobcat TV. Today, we have information on the BNHS hecklers volleyball, as well as another edition of What's Going On, Ron. These stories and more, I'm Clayton Altman. And I'm Nick Howard. Bobcat TV starts now. If you are interested in joining the wrestling team, Please speak to Coach Arnelas in CT201 or Coach Johnson in AC350 for more information. Last week, Tabitha Haynes interviewed the BNHS hecklers. Here's what they had to say. Hey, Bobcats. Today, I'm here with... Enrique Canales. Jordan Vance. Izzy Espinosa. So, Byron Nelson's hecklers is officially a club. So Enrique, what can we expect from that? What is the hecklers exactly? So basically, we're the baddest muchachos around, all right? We're, we come out to basically all sporting events. We try to support our guys and our girls, and we're just trying to spread uh, school spirit because Byron Nelson is the greatest high school on the face of the planet. And where can we find information if anyone wants to join? Um, Coach Trotter's room, AC 106. If you are interested in competing in Destination Imagination, Please see Miss Harper in AC340 for more information. Come find out what your favorite extracurricular activity when you are in elementary school looks like on the high school level. The BNHS school store in the Student Union offers Byron Blue and Black Spear items, sale items, and features new shirt designs. The school store accepts cash, checks, and credit cards. And now for another edition of What's Going On, Ron. Welcome back, Bobcats, with another episode of What's Going On, Ron. I'm here with today's special guest, Dr. Myers. Smooth Ashton, it's good to be here. So with all the construction going on around the school building and all the questions about Chick-fil-A, is there any new thing, new subjects, any new food that could be built? Well, you know, uh, Ashton, uh, we, we, you and I had been talking a little bit about this earlier, and in fact, uh, this morning, uh, I was talking with someone else about uh, bringing Chick-fil-A sandwiches back. And uh, I, while I might be a Popeyes fan, uh, I would be willing to, uh, to reach out to those that make those decisions to see if that's a possibility to bring uh, Chick-fil-A sandwiches back. Um, as far as, uh, we're kind of dependent upon whether or not the restaurant chooses to do that. They have to look at their costs to see um, if their costs will afford them uh, the opportunity to do that, to recover whatever the cost of the sandwich is. But I, I, I can promise our students that I will make the phone calls to the people to let them know that we're interested in that and whether or not they choose to follow through with that, uh, we'll just wait and see. But um, it's Chick-fil-A I know is a very popular item for our students. Um, but don't forget the pot pies, chicken it, sandwich oh, too. We're not getting into this oh, today. Okay, all right. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on another episode of Ron, What's Going On Ron. We'll see, see you guys you. next time. Tomorrow, the United States Navy will be in the Student Union during all lunch periods. Students may choose to stop by and learn about post-high school military opportunities. That's all we have for this edition of Bobcat TV. See you next time and have a great day, Bobcats. Bobcats.